In this video, we're going to be taking a look at the exchange balance feature of the RetroMic mining tools. One of the newer features of the Mining Tools app is the ability to view your exchange balance. So if you're not aware, one of the features is you can have the system auto exchange your currencies for you. So if you mine to an exchange, you can have it auto exchange. However, a lot of times exchanges have minimum balances that are required in order to trade. Um, this is really popular with things like CoinAx and Trade Ogre, where with Trade Ogre you have to have a certain BTC equivalent of trade value before it'll actually allow you to trade that specific currency. So what you can do is you can head over to the auto exchanging section. You configure your exchanges. You can say I already have TXBit, Trade Ogre, CoinX, KuCoin, and South Exchange configured. <clears throat> and if we click on any of these and give it a second, it's going to pull in all of my balances that I have on the exchange. Uh, it's not going to pull in fiat value yet. I'm still considering adding that feature, but I haven't yet. Uh, for now, this is going to be the amount in that native currency. So here you can see I have 0.62 chain coin, I have 0.11 dash, uh, 0.05 doge, um, pretty much no caspa, pretty much no neoxa. This is pretty much just left over from auto exchanges. Uh, and then if we jump over to Trade Ogre, you're going to see the same thing. You can see all my balances I have on Trade Ogre, and you're going to see some higher balances here. Again, these haven't met that threshold yet to auto exchange for BTC. So that's why uh, they're, you're seeing a higher number here. Once that hits that threshold, it'll auto trade. Uh, CoinX, we can see I've, uh, it actually auto traded last night all my balances. So right now I'm just sitting at 999 pre tokens. <clears throat> uh, KuCoin, same thing, right? You can see that I have a tiny balance of Decred and Tether. Uh, but I've got 18 pre and then South Exchange here. We can see similar thing. So the South Exchange coin uh, That they kind of airdropped everybody I got five of those and then I have 0.09 dash here and then very little BTC and this all aligns with the trading schemes that I have set up right so on TXBit, I would expect to have the most dash, which I do because I'm auto exchanging into that. Trader, I would expect to have the most BTC, which I do. I have 0.001 there. Uh, CoinX and KuCoin, I'm both exchanging into pre search. And South Exchange, I'm trading into dash. So this kind of gives you a quick view of all your balances and also shows you that the auto exchanging feature is working. So this is one of the things that you can leverage. Uh, and you don't have to turn on auto exchanging to leverage this. If you just want to use this tool to see your balances as a quick view, you can come in and you can configure the exchanges, set enabled to false, uh, as long as you set up your API key, your API secret. And if you're on KuCoin, make sure you set up your passphrase. It will pull them in for you uh, without actually executing auto exchanging. So it's a feature that pretty much anybody can take advantage of. You just got to set up your API keys and API secrets. But that's it for this video. Thanks for watching. Let me know you guys thoughts on being able to view the balances. And if you would like to see a fiat currency uh, column here as well, definitely let me know.